Tin Man. Jackie, you gonna say hi? Jackie in the back there, chilling. Works out a little better if he doesn't have to see my face all the time, so that's why I keep him behind me. If he sees my face, he's a lousy uh, face. Not like I always look grumpy. I'm not just always grumpy. Anyways, um... What I'm doing here? Hold on for a second, some noise. So, firemen are still here, warming up their truck. <clears throat> I'm back in Mission. And I just happened to be by the Pizza Hut here, because they have Wi-Fi that I can tie into. And I'm doing uploads. Doing a few right now. Went to a place and did one or two this morning. And so, probably have around five going up or something. And I thought I would just um, let you know what I'm doing here. I'm doing this for you, for me, for our kids, for our next generation, for the world. That's what I'm doing here. So if you want to join in in any way, then do it safely. Do it wisely. Realize that you are you really are working in the wild. So don't put yourself at harm's way. Try to be sensible in everything you do. Um, doesn't it mean anybody's going to be becoming harmed. We don't know any of that information. You know, there's speculation on different things out there. There's also different species we're dealing with. I'm totally in the realm of realizing that, that I've dealt with two different species, for sure, of animals, beings, you know, creatures of the forest, however you want to look at it. I know I've dealt with somebody with a big foot, but I also know I deal with someone else, too, so... And they seem unrelated in some ways, so... Yeah. That's why I'm out here. People, Some people may be looking at me thinking, okay, well, this is weird. Or he's weird. And then some people may be... Some people may be looking at me and... Um, getting it. Maybe not getting it to the extent that I'm trying to oppress it. And then there's others out there that talk to me that I know that they're getting it to the same level. A lot of people are looking at it like, oh, it's just life. You know, whatever. But you know what? If we up in Canada would have looked at the pine beetle problem earlier, we wouldn't. Uh, we would have realized it wasn't just life. And so now we ended up having a big problem with the pine beetle up here in Canada. People would have been noticing it years before, but, oh, it's just life. So I'm noticing all this stuff, and no, it's not just life. It's nature, it's knowledge, it's information. It's being put out to whoever's connecting with it and seeing and understanding, getting information from it. It's being put out to us for a reason, and my big thing on that is the reason is to tell you guys... You know, I'm not being silly like I'm some kind of a prophet or something like that. But this is first-hand information, Tin Man style. And there's other ones out there that have it their style. And, uh, you know, people's names don't always come to me. But there's a few out there that uh, I respect watching their show. I don't have a lot of time to watch some shows, but... Uh, you know, I'll put out a, a shadow video to the people that I enjoy learning from and and hearing from and watching and observing their style and such like that. So everybody stay safe who's out there in the field and whoever else is learning about the field, cool. I hope now some of my family starting to learn because you live in heavily populated areas where it's just starting to change to a lot of population for some reason. The population is changing a lot. It's growing a lot. So, 
Yeah, Vancouver Island's huge. It's just covered, so that's that. I'm out of here. Peace out from Tin Man. And the Squatch Hound. He's awesome, but he's just losing his character for other dogs because of uh, being out there in the bush, I think. He's got so many scents going through his mind. You know, maybe he thinks he's a Sasquatch now. <laughs> Peace out, Tin Man.